Lovely play by the Brazilian. Takes it off him superbly. Cruz sets him free. Vinicius down the left. This is why we love the class. In the heartland of samba rhythms, Brazil stands renowned for its boundless reservoir of footballing talent. Every year, a fresh crop of gifted young players sprout forth, harboring immense potential to make their mark on the global stage. In the 2021-2022 season, the emergence of a youthful Brazilian winger, Vinicius Jr., left an indelible mark on the Los Blancos squad, notably in his capacity to dismantle the opponent's defences. His pivotal role in facilitating Karim Benzema's goal-scoring spree crowned him as the catalyst for Real Madrid's success. As the curtains drew on the 2021-2022 season, Vinicius Jr.'s trajectory was poised to propel him to the status of the most valuable young player, potentially surpassing even established stars like Neymar. But what lies at the heart of Vinicius Jr.'s ascent to becoming Real Madrid's newest luminary? The tale unfolds thus, Vinicius Jr. was born on July 12, 2000, in São Goncalo, Brazil, where, much like the majority of Brazilian children, his formative years were steeped in the culture of football. His passion for the sport was monumental. It's a common thread among many Brazilian footballers to have arisen from humble beginnings, from legends like Ronaldinho, Ronaldo Nazorio, to Neymar, who were sculpted by adversity and deprivation. Thus, it's no surprise that countless Brazilian youngsters harbour dreams of football in greatness, viewing it as a means to uplift their families and rewrite the course of their lives. Many are willing to sacrifice formal education in favour of their singular devotion to football. In the vein of numerous illustrious Brazilian footballers, Vinicius Jr. hails from a modest background and, as such, had to wage a relentless struggle to bring his dreams to fruition. Owing to financial constraints, joining a prestigious football academy in Brazil was beyond his reach. Nonetheless, his parents recognized Vinicius' boundless enthusiasm for the sport and managed to secure a spot for him at a small local club in Goncalo. A year later, a pivotal opportunity beckoned when the renowned Brazilian outfit, Flamengo, conducted talent trials for budding players. Vinicius eagerly grasped the chance and, through sheer determination, triumphed. Carlos Eduardo Abrantes, the astute scout who first uncovered Vinicius' prodigious talent, was immediately captivated by the young star's speed and dribbling prowess from their very first training session together. Despite training alongside older and more experienced players, Vinicius swiftly adapted and showcased his exceptional abilities. This marked the beginning of his journey, as he was subsequently signed by a prominent club, commencing his career as a professional footballer. Vinicius Jr. came into this world in Rio de Janeiro, precisely in São Goncalo, an enclave renowned for its modest, lower-middle-income populace. Initially, he may not have uttered much, but when he graced the field, he unfurled his prowess as an incredibly swift player endowed with distinctive attributes. Carlos, in a recent interview, disclosed that Vinicius initially found his way into SSB Flamengo through a scholarship program necessitated by his underprivileged family background, where the academy shouldered both his footballing and financial needs. Though his early life bore the weight of adversity, Vinicius sensed a transformative shift when he made the transition to Flamengo. A dozen years were spent honing his skills within Flamengo's academy, and at the tender age of 15, he took a bold step, forsaking his formal education to immerse himself fully in the world of football. His remarkable talent allowed him to navigate every facet of the Flamengo Academy with aplomb, earning the admiration of many. Beyond the domestic stage, he also steered the Brazilian U-15 national team to victory in the 2015 Copa America. Two years later, in 2017 to be precise, Vinicius Jr. played an instrumental role in propelling the Brazil U-17 national team to glory in the Copa America U-17. During the competition, he clinched both the best player and top scorer titles, amassing a formidable total of seven goals. Vinicius' extraordinary showing not only sent ripples through Brazil but also reverberated across Europe.
Carlos Amador, coach of Brazil's U-17 team, underscored Vinicius' lofty technical ability and prowess, positioning him as a potential star on the global footballing stage. Thanks to his outstanding contributions on the international scene, Vinicius secured his maiden professional contract before even turning 17, signing a two-year deal with Flamengo featuring a buyout clause worth a staggering €40 million. Euros. In his inaugural season as a professional player, he carved his path into Flamengo's first team with a brand of captivating play that swiftly garnered him a legion of fervent admirers. His style often drew comparisons to Robinho, the Brazilian forward who once set the footballing world ablaze. With his blistering speed, mesmerizing dribbling skills, and an innate ability to transform the game into a dance when the ball graced his feet, Vinicius frequently orchestrated feats that commanded the awe of the audience. Carlos Eduardo, the astute scout who unearthed Vinicius' talent, proclaimed that he consistently emerged as the leading goalscorer in virtually every competition he graced, underlining his unique and exceptional qualities. In the nascent stages of his career, Vinicius Jr. etched six goals and supplied three assists across 17 matches in all competitions. While these numbers didn't quite meet the bar of satisfaction, his breathtaking performances, coupled with his virtuoso dribbling prowess, ignited a fierce bidding war among prominent European clubs, with Barcelona and Real Madrid vying for his signature. After meticulous contemplation, Vinicius ultimately cast his lot with Real Madrid during the 2017-2018 season, finding the allure of their project more compelling than Barcelona's. In this pivotal juncture, the guidance of Real Madrid stalwarts Marcelo and Casemiro played a decisive role in Vinicius's choice to join the club. A substantial sum of €45 million Euros changed hands as Real Madrid secured his services, marking him as the second most expensive Brazilian youth sensation, trailing only behind Neymar. Nevertheless, Vinicius had to bide his time until he reached the age of 18 before officially donning the white jersey in the summer of 2018. Upon his entry into El Real, Vinicius Jr. was not thrust directly into the first team but instead found himself plying his trade for Real Madrid Castilla in the second tier. There, he showcased his skills with four goals in just five games, which promptly earned him a summons to the first team by the watchful gaze of coach Zinedine Zidane. However, the season carried a weighty challenge, with the loss of their talismanic forward Cristiano Ronaldo to Juventus, necessitating a capable replacement. Despite the lofty expectations and the void left by Ronaldo, Vinicius Jr. grappled to meet the fans' hopes, especially in the domains of goal-scoring and assist provision. His inaugural season yielded a tally of merely three goals and 12 assists from 31 games, with just one goal to his name in La Liga. Yet, it is paramount to remember that Vinicius Jr. was a mere 19 years old, with an abundance of time to nurture his talents at the hallowed Bernabeu. In his sophomore season of 2019-2020, Vinicius still bore the hallmark of an evolving player. Despite earning ample opportunities to grace the pitch in almost every encounter, he could only muster five goals and four assists across 38 matches. His third season marked a continuation of this trajectory, with the demand for an impressive record remaining unmet. Nonetheless, in the 2020-2021 season, under the stewardship of coach Carlo Ancelotti following Zidane's departure, Vinicius Jr. commenced to find his rhythm on the field, amassing a record of six goals and seven assists from 49 matches. The 2021-2022 season witnessed a pivotal shift, as the change in leadership from Zinedine Zidane to Carlo Ancelotti heralded Vinicius Jr.'s ascent as the fresh icon cherished by El Real aficionados. The dawn of the 2021-2022 season saw Real Madrid kick off with a rather satisfying string of results and it was the dynamic duo of Karim Benzema and Vinicius Jr. who emerged as the standout performers. While Benzema had long been hailed as a star in his own right, Vinicius Jr.'s development left the Madridistas deeply impressed. The Brazilian winger displayed a remarkable surge in his goal-scoring and assist contributions, positioning himself as the linchpin behind Karim Benzema's record-breaking feats in La Liga and the Champions League during that season. 
Vinicius even took centre stage in Real Madrid's Champions League triumph over Liverpool, etching his name in history with a pivotal goal. Carlo Ancelotti's unwavering trust infused Vinicius with a surge in confidence, making him one of the cornerstones of the team's 14th UCL victory. Under Ancelotti's tutelage in the 2021-2022 season, Vinicius underwent a metamorphosis, sharpening his skills as both a prolific goalscorer and a deft provider for Karim Benzema. Across 52 appearances in all competitions, Vinicius amassed an impressive tally of 22 goals and 22 assists, a testament to Ancelotti's ability to create space for him. Despite his tender age of 21, Vinicius embodied the quintessential prospect for Real Madrid's next generation, underlined by a substantial 170 appearances for the club, reflecting his season-playing experience. Throughout that season, Vinicius emphatically silenced naysayers with his performances, cementing the notion that Real Madrid's significant investment in him was indeed justified. By 2022, he had skyrocketed to become one of the most valuable young talents in the world, commanding a staggering market value of 100 million euros. If Vinicius can maintain consistency and steer clear of the pitfalls of a flamboyant nightlife and the allure of stardom, there's every reason to believe that he could ascend to become one of the world's premier talents in the future. His journey demands relentless dedication, unwavering self-assurance, and an unyielding spirit to chase the dreams of a footballer and transcend all limitations. This makes Vinicius Jr. an extraordinary narrative for the future of both Real Madrid and Brazilian football.